Hi everyone, this is Alan Franz and it's Tuesday. That means it's time for Tuesday's Tips and Tricks for PowerPoint. Thanks for joining me today. What I wanna do is show you a really cool but very simple way to make a really cool presentation using PowerPoint using one image and um, the morph transition. So without further ado, let me just show you what I'm gonna do today is I am going to delete these placeholders and paste in an image that I compiled using the uh, icons available uh, in PowerPoint. And these are two different icons using trees. So if you do a little search for tree icons, you will come up with these. And that's basically a compi compilation of these two icons. Um, and I've modified it a little bit. Uh, that is for another day, uh, the modifying. Uh, basically, the purpose of this is to show you exactly uh, what can be done using a single image and um, the morph transition. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to just start out with this uh, here. And I'm gonna, we're going to talk about trees today. So I'm going to put trees here for our presentation that bigger good okay we'll duplicate this we'll get rid of the trees and what we want to do is paste in this text that I got from Wikipedia about trees and we will adjust that text uh, to be how we want it to look we'll probably make that a little bit bigger okay and then I'm gonna change the image around a little bit so this entire image doesn't have to fit in the entire screen so I'm gonna hit the shift key and zoom uh, or enlarge that picture uh, image and I'm gonna place the text right in between the two deciduous trees all right we can make it even larger so I'm, uh, that's what I'm gonna do and we will make put the text there let's make it larger stretch it out so it fits good good and so that's what we want our first slide to look like and then we're going to make a similar change to the second slide so we're going to talk about evergreen trees for the second slide and uh, these are pretty big so let me just shrink it down so we have a little bit more context And then I'll move the text box over to the left. We'll left align that because it's on the left side. And we'll change the text here to the evergreen text. There we are. So that is our second um, slide. And you can continue on. You, you kind of get the idea. Um, and what I'll do is I'll just duplicate this um, and say thanks for learning about trees. And we don't have to have that all on one, one line. And we will again make that a little bit wider. Okay, good. And so we just want to make sure that our transition is set to morph on all of these. And here we are. Our presentation is done. Let's check it out trees and we zoom in on the deciduous trees and learn about deciduous and then we move over to the evergreen trees and we learn about evergreen trees and uh, then finally thanks for learning about trees thanks so much uh, I hope you enjoyed this tip and how easy it can be to make a really cool and effective presentation just by using a single image and the morph transition. Thanks so much. If you like this tip, please hit the like button, subscribe to the channel. Uh, I appreciate it. Thanks.